Hey everybody, it's Pluto, and welcome back to Super Mario, no, Super Luigi Galaxy 35. Not actually. Uh, but, you know, we have 35 lives, so I might as well say it's Super Luigi Galaxy 35. I'm so sad that Super Mario Bros. 35 was removed. And I hope it comes back at some point. I don't know if it will. And it might, it might come back when this video goes out. But I don't know. But probably won't. Just because of Nintendo. I didn't even get a chance to play it because I didn't I don't have Nintendo Switch online, so one day. One day I will play something Nintendo online. Right back into space junk. Oh, the music's different. I mean, it's cool because it's the the airship theme. But also, I kind of like Space Junk Galaxy's music as well, so, as previously mentioned. But anyway, gonna ruin the Super Mario Galaxy 35 by growing this one up. Unless I die. Unless I die! Oh my goodness, I long jumped and then hit the ground and then slid. Actually, I think Luigi's slide might not be able to fall off an edge. <gasps> oh my gosh. I actually ledge, ledge grabbed properly, like a proper ledge grab. I wonder if Luigi's slide can't actually... Oh, I guess it can't if it grabs the ledge. But there are probably ledges that can't be grabbed, is the thing. Okay, just gonna grab a few star bits. Along the path. Or not. Okay. Oh, that was a lot of flutter jump. I think with Luigi's second, like his double jump counts as a kind of flutter jump type of thing. Anyway, let me grab this and get... Oh, in there, please. I want the star bits in here since there are quite a few in here, I remember. Yeah, look at all this. Amazing. And let's actually get over to the other ship now. Well, that was a fast turnaround from that shell being tossed and another Koopa Trooper spawning. Oh, sliding. Oh, sliding! <laughs> I slid... I was sliding towards the edge, so I jumped. And then... And then, um, the bridge fell down and slammed me right into the black hole. Okay, well, let's try this again. This time without sliding off any edges or just getting slammed by a bridge. That must hurt. I want to know just how much damage Luigi would have taken by getting slammed by a bridge. By that particular bridge. Oh, actually throw please, thank you. I like Luigi's run as well. It's, it's amusing me, just like everything else about Luigi. Oh, there's the shell. Probably need to actually pay attention to this fight. Ow. I'm just trying to fight you. Take that. Ow. So I do feel like that was another move. It possibly might not be in this game. It might be Super Mario Galaxy that you can do that particular move. Maybe. Can I have a shell, please? Thank you. I also like this wand. It's very cool that it's a star in the top. I'm just gonna keep telling you things that I like about the game.
But going back to Super Mario Bros. 35, uh, it'd be cool to have, like, for YouTubers to get together and then do 35 player races. It'd be difficult to get all of the, like, perspectives, I guess. But I guess, yeah, I don't know. I don't know how you'd do it. I guess each person could, like, share their, their view, and then everyone edits it so it looks like a, uh, a 99 or 35 round thing. On their own perspective. <laughs> How do you, like, get 35 people together and get them to, like, talk and not just sound like chaos? Just absolute chaos? I mean, 35 people is a fair bit for one one video call, basically. It'd probably be just better for each individual race participant to just have their own, like, their own commentary for their own actual full video. Also, Cosmic Luigi is apparently a thing because we're not going to be racing Cosmic Mario in these races. And I don't know... Oh, it... Oh, it definitely is. Oh, it definitely is. It's... Oh. Oh, no. The Cosmic Luigi looks to be a lot harder. Oh, dear. A lot harder. A lot harder. A lot harder. I'm going to skip over that if I can, please. That's not going to help me. Oh, no. Cosmic Luigi is way harder. He's way harder. It's not just... Oh, please. Oh, please. Oh, please. Oh, please. Oh, please. It's not just a reused Mario. It's actually faster. I'm not sure if that's just it sped up to match Luigi's speed, or if it's an actual different, like, recorded uh, inputs. Oh, my goodness. <sighs> I was completely thrown off by that. But anyway, I think we're doing pretty well in this this dome now. So let's head over to the other one and do the other comet there. Because uh, I'm actually doing it in a way, surprisingly now, that the comets will actually appear every star instead of every second star. I don't know how I managed to do it so weird last time, but it's fine. Speedy Comet. Right, for the f the first star, I think. Pool Path Speed... Pool Star Path Speed Run. <laughs> try saying that ten times fast. Pool Star Path Speed... Speed Run. Pool, pool Star Path Speed Run. Pool Star Path Speed Run. Oh my goodness. Anyway, let's just go straight away. Just go, just go, just go, just go. Oh, so this is kind of an L. I don't think there are hidden L's to see. But I'm going to point out whenever I see an L anyway. Oh, grab, grab, grab. This should be the last two, right? Yep. Go, please. Okay. Just go fast. Oh, pull. Pull star. Pull star. Pull. Pull me. Oh, how did I grab that? I don't even know, but now I'm going at full speed and was, I think, overlapping with some of the areas where I'm supposed to be hitting the blocks in the way. Oh my goodness, I was barely touching the gravity for any kind of amount of time. I 
I was really hoping to like get up there quickly, but nope. Game's not gonna let me do that. Oh, game. Please. There we go. I'm fine now. Oh, <laughs> sliding again. Here we go. Nope. <sighs> I shouldn't have risked that again. Since last the last time I did that, it worked out barely. <sighs> I have to redo this entire thing now. I shouldn't risk jumps like that on a speed run or any kind of comet for that matter. Oh, please get that. Please get it. Thank you. Oh, Luigi, get moving. There we go. Going back to the 35 people thing, I guess if the commentary was separate as well, like the people had their own separate commentary, they could actually do like groups of people as well, so that some of the audio overlaps with the conversation. Oh, just to be interesting. Okay. Let's go faster. Oh my goodness, flinging myself all over the place. Ow! Oh my goodness, pain. The fur is made of spikes or something. No, you have to actually be touching the ground for that to actually work. And do the animation, apparently. I guess they want to make sure that you're not in the middle of where it's going to be before they move it, which makes sense. Okay, go, 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 go. Oh my goodness, that turn. That slippery turn. Oh, too far. I need to get this one first. Or I guess, whatever. I shouldn't be... I shouldn't be risking everything. I shouldn't be risking everything. But I did. And I'm alright. As long as I make it back in one piece. Okay. Oh, platform up here for me. Okay. This is good. This is actually great. I only spent five, six minutes. Maybe, maybe a bit more on that. Spent a while on that because of failing a few things. That's fine. There we go. I'm gonna not save. Live life on the edge with 30 something lives. Let's head to space junk. I'm getting through it fairly well. I think this next one is also the, f the one that I like probably the most in this level. Oh, it's also got the Hungry Luma that I need to do, so I should, I should remember that and get the Star Bits as quickly as possible early on. I don't think there are any on this planet, though. There are over here, though. So let's get these ones. All of them. All of them. Where's the... Oh, I went the wrong way. It's on the opposite, opposite side of the planet. That's fine. Grab all of these. Okay, there we go. I don't remember how many I need, but I should be fairly close, right? How many do I need? Got any tasty star bits? If you feed me a bunch, I will grow in size. 
and then become a planet for you. Which conveniently just has a star on it. Um, I need to get another few more star bits. Oh, hello, Goomba. You'll be a good sacrifice. Grab those. Okay, that's good enough. Now to figure out where in space I am. Because this is a little bit maze-like in its design. Oh, there's the Hungry Luma. I can't feed you from down here, can I? No, that'd be silly. I think I'm slightly lost. That's okay. I'll find my way out. Uh, this way? No, this other way. Actually. There's also a pool star hit that, that can help get out, I guess. And I'm surprised that this isn't ice, or considered ice. Um, I can't see where the Hungry Limer is. There it is. So hungry. Oh, it is slippery though, so why is it not considered ice and I can't skate on it? Anyway, there we go. Transform! And there's Yoshi's face. Um, I'm gonna see if I can get as many as possible into one place, which means I'm gonna have to get them to chase me. Which is not exactly easy. Come on. Come on, my legion. It's super difficult to get them all in one place. Also, I'm gonna die, so I need to be careful. No! Why? They all just stop seeing me for some reason. The aggro on enemies is a little bit strange. Um, where's the star? There. Just follow the, the line of pink. I think it's pink, right? I don't know. Maybe I should just try to stay slightly ahead of them. No, they still stop. Nope. And now I probably can't get extremely great numbers on that. I don't know what the exact numbers I need are for that either. No, why? Oh my goodness, I don't like trying to get the bounces on this. Because it's just so pointless. Take that. Take that. And take that. And take that. Camera's upside down because it doesn't know what to do. This last one. There we go. Very nice. Another new galaxy. Still no Hungry Luma. I'm saving now, apparently. I forgot I was not going to be saving after every star. But then I have been anyway. There's another regular star here. Of course, because I got the hidden star in this level, didn't I? Which was the Hungry Luma. Skip the opening cutscenes. There are star bits there when you first get onto that planet. Were they there last time? I can't remember. I didn't think there were any the first time. Maybe I'm crazy. Okay, let's get into this thing. Right next to this pool star. Ah, uh, nope, wrong way. It's 
like right around the corner from where you first get in. There it is. Not even hitting any of those things, just this one, I guess, but still. It seems like you don't hit any of those at all, except for the one. Which is strange. But anyway, let's sling ourselves around. Bye, Toad. You will be missed. You can just- Oh, he's going to that planet now, apparently. Guess he didn't get sling- sl slunged. Again, didn't sling him far enough for the gravity to take effect. It's a very small gravity pocket. I don't know how gravity can be in a pocket. But it is, so... Let's-a go! Bye, Luigi! Okay, the toad does nothing. I wanted to see if that did anything, but nope, it just does nothing. If it was a use- if you could use the toad as a... Um... As an attack, that'd be cool. But nope. I don't know how that works just now. Toad, get back in the thing, I'll shoot you at it. You know, teamwork. I'm sure you want to work with the famous Luigi. Right? Everybody's heard of Luigi. Oh. Ow. The cursor disappeared for some reason. Oh my goodness. Don't die. Oh, why did you stop moving? Just because of gravity changing does not mean the controls have to go weird. But anyway, let's get... This... And... That... And... Last one. There we go. And then I sent him into the sun. And then I got his star from... All the way over there to somehow spawn over here. Okay, we're getting close to the end of this dome, I think. Although I think I didn't haven't even gone into Battle Rock yet. I've still just done the first galaxy. But also I think the other two galaxies are just single stars, I think. Oh, Hunky Loom is there. Probably needs another 400 star bits. How many do I have? I saved again. Star bits, 497. I think that's enough. I'm pretty sure there was two that needed 400, right? Just like there are two that need 12,000. 1,200. That's that, that one. Oh my goodness, 12,000 star bits. That's it, I'm stuffed. Here we go. Transform! Slingpod Galaxy. I remember doing... Excellent at this one. Nothing bad happened at all. I wasn't in a very sticky situation, as the star seems to imply. Okay. Let me... Be very careful. And sling myself slightly early. And then... Go. I think the... The star bits around here orbit... The entire... The, the entire maze, I guess. So I'm gonna... Go that way. So I can get these star bits to appear. Which might make Amy a little bit easier. Just a little bit. As long as I don't actually collect them too early. Just gonna grab all that straight away. And go. And I did a lot better than I did the first time. Apparently. Apparently. 
I can't figure out what's different about this time compared to last time. I just can't put my finger on it. Actually, wait. There we go. Puts finger on the on the monitor. Onto the screen where Luigi is. Except it doesn't change the way that it works in the level, so... I can't really blame Luigi for doing better than Mario. It's just a normal thing, right? You can't blame Luigi for being better than Mario. Okay. Let's do this. I think there's also... Yeah, I want to do Hurry Scurry Galaxy again. Since it's here. I probably won't... Well, maybe... Maybe I might try to stay on it as long as possible. But that... Okay, I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm gonna do something a little bit dangerous. Just a little bit dangerous, don't worry. It's fine. I'm not gonna spend much time on this first planet, obviously, because that's cheating. But I am gonna spend a little bit of extra time on the planet after. Oh, oh, I nearly fell straight off. <laughs> oh, that's not a good start. It's not a good sign. Also, coins really have no extra use in the game. Oh, I probably need to actually collect these quickly, don't I? Because they probably disappear after a bit. I was gonna, like, jump on every single platform to make it, um, like, last as long as possible. <gasps> ooh, ooh, like, kind of like that, but a little bit more or less dangerous. But then, also, the notes will disappear eventually, I'm pretty sure. I missed it. It's, it's, you have to get every single panel, because otherwise you're wasting a Luma's life. Just remember that when you skip to the next area. Just, when you grab the star, just remember you're wasting a Luma's life. If you don't stand on every single panel on the planet. Okay, there we go. Time to orbit the planet and then fling myself off into space and die. I wonder if there is a way to actually, like, swing around the planet enough that he actually flings your way. Save that. Hang on. Just changing monitor settings randomly. Okay, let's go. Probably to Battle Rock then. The next Bowser level is ready for us, but... You know, we can wait. Bowser can wait. He's not gonna start the Galactic Empire reactor thing without us, so... <laughs> he has to wait until we get there to start, so we will take our time. I'm sure he doesn't mind that much. Man, think about that though, you kind of don't like it when other people kind of just take their time in like arriving somewhere that you plan to meet. So, um, maybe, I, 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 I still got three more stars in this level to do though. So might as well do those. I've still got time. Bowser's still got time, right? Right. Oh, there I go. <laughs> there I go. The ga Hang on, I want to do that again. The the gravity on this planet is a little bit weird because of all the planets nearby. Hang on. Can I get rid of this top man thing? Okay, there we go. It doesn't actually spin me, like, launch me any further away than I think it does normally, but it it feels like it does just because of the, the camera. Perfect. <laughs> a perfect long jump. Actually, I wonder if I can actually get to the launch star without... If I long jump... No, I don't think so. Hang on.
Yeah, I don't think it's going to work. That's a shame. Anyway, let's pull ourselves into that. And luckily, this level, this this star isn't that long, as well. Is this the correct thing to do? Is just orbit this thing? I mean, you might be safe for most of this. <laughs> if you're careful. <laughs> oh my goodness, bouncing off of it. Oh, electricity is scary. Hello, I'm back. Just gonna long jump straight into electricity. And then through a cannonball thing. Oh no, more electricity. I'm gonna die if I'm not careful, so I'm gonna hold off on that for another second or two. <gasps> nope. <laughs> I shouldn't have been crazy. I shouldn't. Yeah. That's fine. It's. There's a checkpoint, right? Yeah, it's not as close as I would like, but there's still. I get star bits from this. And fun. I get fun from this. From flinging myself around this moving platform. <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm flinging myself so much. I think it doesn't, like, it flings me further away because of it moving. So if I long jump away from it, I think I get flung around a lot more. Whee! Oh no, I hit something! Whee! Oh my goodness, I'm flinging myself over that! Oh, it doesn't even know what to do when you stand on that. That's interesting. Oh, I'm 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 upside down. This is far too much fun to not do at this point. Oh, bad bad move. That's fine. I've still got health. I'm going to be careful though. <laughs> so I'm going to keep launching myself and try to avoid things, basically. Is that, was that, that's what that means, right? Being careful. Oh, this is bad. Okay, 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 good. Let's get some coins. <laughs> so I don't die. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. I only died once. You can't blame me for dying once. If I die twice though, then it's my fault. Except that sometimes that's not true. Particularly when I die because of my own fault. Because then it's not my fault. It's my clone. One of them at least. But anyway, I think with that, that is probably it for this episode. So thank you all for watching. And I will see you all next time.